Berge was successful as a coach because he was focused on the athlete's success. He invested in teaching and passing on his knowledge of high jump to his jumpers. He taught his athletes to set goals, work hard, celebrate wins, and bounce back from losses. We all knew Berge would retire someday, but we always hoped it would be next year or maybe even a few years later. When I think of Dave, I always think of his smile and his positive attitude. And as a coach, that's an attribute that I strive to have. Dave was super great. He was really like the deciding factor for me to go there. And luckily I did because as soon as I went there, my high jump height increased by about four inches. <laughs> we always joke that if I would have been there four years, who knows what I could have done. And I don't doubt that at all um, because Dave is such an amazing coach. He gave such good support and I learned so much under just two years working with him. Uh, if it weren't for you, I wouldn't be where I'm at today. I wouldn't have had the success I did when I was a Dragon. Um, you've inspired me to take on coaching for uh, the next uh, generation out there as well. Uh, you deserve any appreciation you can get in more. Um, one of my favorite memories was when we were in California for a national meet, outdoor nationals. And I competed in the heptathlon uh, the first two days we were out there. Um, had a good high jump, had good marks in all my other events, um, ended up being All-American. And then the final day got to do the open high jump competition. And I'll never forget missing my opening height twice, looking across the track at Dave outside the fence, probably wondering what was going through his head. Um, but um, whatever his advice was, it got me through and um, ended up having a PR that day. And, tying the first place height, but placing third. Um, so definitely one of my favorite memories um, being with Dave. I remember him wanting to meet us high jumpers prior to the season. And we were at this little table outside the concession stand talking and immediately his love for the Dragons, his commitment to coaching and his organization was evident. Um, who else, I mean, makes a Excel spreadsheet to calculate the Pythagorean theorem to guarantee you have a right angle as you approach the bar. He's the best coach you could ask for. I mean, no, name someone else who has more knowledge and, and is more willing to give back to um, someone who's really, really intermediate versus someone who's really advanced. I mean, he's coaching me versus Trevor Bari. Like, we're on two different scales, and yet he, he knows what he's talking about. He's the coach that can bring it down to such a beginner level for, you know, maybe someone who's never high jumped also to a professional level, which is incredible and, and something to be admired for sure. Uh, I think anyone that's ever worked with Dave knows that he um, definitely cares about the whole athlete, um, not just on the track, but outside too. Um, it's been 10 plus years since I've been competing and I still keep in touch with Dave and Trish and know that they um, have always just had such great support and have been so welcoming. And um, I know that our friendship will continue and just want to give a shout out to Dave and say thanks for everything that you've done for me as a person, but also for all things Dragon Track and Field. Hey Coach B, just wanted to say thank you for everything you've done uh, for the track team and the legacy that you leave behind, uh, specifically allowing me to continue my track career and academics at MSUM and believing in me and my potential. Thank you. So Dave, thank you for all you've given to the Dragon Track and Field program. Um, enjoy retirement. Thank you, Coach. I appreciate it, Dave. You'll never know how much you've touched me, but you'll never know how much you've touched all of the athletes at MSUM and MSUM as a whole in general. Thank you, Bergie, for all your contributions to Dragon Field and Track. You made a difference, my friend. I, I really enjoyed having you as a coach. I know everybody else did as well. And now I look forward to keeping you around as a friend as well. So thank you so much, Dave. Enjoy retirement. Everybody's got to retire at some point. I'm just glad I got all my years with him. <laughs> so thanks, Dave. Thanks for all you've done for me. Thanks for the big impact that you had on my career as an athlete and me as a student in general. Um, you're the best, and I wish you nothing but the best. Thanks, Dave. Raise the bar. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Man. All right. Let's That's go. That's what we wanted. Absolutely. Yes. Yes.